Assalamu alaikum. I am Nilkar Yasmin. Hello my dear students, how are you? I hope all of you are fit and fine. I am your science teacher. Welcome to my online class. Dear students, today I discuss with you chapter 10, Introduction to Technology. Dear students, in your last class I discuss with you what is technology and technology in our life. And I also give you our activity which name is use of technology in our life. I hope all of you all did it. So let's focus on today's topics. Today I discuss with you development of technology. Dear students, we use various kinds of technologies for different purposes in our life. When studying, we use technologies such as pencils, textbook or exercise books. Teachers use blackboards, chalk or other instruments to teach. When we travel to carry or carry goods from place to place, we use transport technologies such as bicycle, car, bus, sheep or an airplane. And in agriculture, we use various kinds of tools such as plow, spade, sickle or tractor for cultivation. Dear students, technology is always developing and improving. Improvements in technology make our life better and quicker. So dear students, please take your science book. Open your book, page number 65. Okay. So, dear students, you can see the activity. Its name is Changes of Transport Technology. So, what we have to do? We have to do uh, make, make a diagram like the one shown below. People working on food. Here is three columns. On land, on water and in air. So, dear students, classify the pictures, pictures below into three groups. Transport technologies on land, on water and in air and put them in order from oldest to newest. So you can see some picture of transport technology, helicopter, sailboat, space shuttle, steam train, bus, airplane, raft, horse and ship. So on land. We have to write number one horse, then train, then bus. On water, you have to write raft, sailboat, and ship. In air, helicopter. Airplane or space shuttle. So you have to write at your home. Okay, please turn over your page. Page number sixty-six. Technology is used in various ways in our life, such as transport, study, or agriculture. Now I discuss with you transport. Transport. People invent, invented transport technologies in order to move from place to place and carry goods further and faster. Transport technologies can be classified into three modes. 
land, water and air. In ancient time, people used to travel on foot. Later on, people began to use animals such as horses or cows. After the invention of the wheel, transport technology changed drastically. At first, the horse cart and cow carries was invented. After the invention of the engine, trains and cars were invented. The invention of the wheel and engine made it easier for people to travel and carry goods further and faster. My dear students, you can see three pictures. Picture number one, horse cart. Number two, train. And number three, cart. Horse cart is an ancient, ancient time. People use animals. to travel place on one place to another place. After the invention of the wheel, transport technology changed drastically. As for water transport, people used to use rafts or boats to travel and carry goods across rivers, lakes or oceans. Then people traveled on water sailboats by using wind power. After the invention of the engine, cargo ships, speedboats, and ferries were developed. This carry people and goods throughout the world. So, dear students, you can see the picture of raft, sail, cargo ship. Do you know what is raft? So, dear students, Raft is made from bamboo. Bamboo tree is floating on the water. And you can see a sailboat. We have already known about sailboat. In chapter 6 here, we can see in the river which is driven by a man. When we traveled on water with sailboats by using wind power. Then you can see a picture of cargo ship. Do you know what is cargo ship? A cargo ship size is big. People used this to carry people and goods throughout the world. Aeroplane and helicopters also traveled, travel in the air. We can travel long distance in a short time through the air. Now people can travel to the moon through space shuttle. You can also see a picture of aeroplane, helicopter and space shuttle. Education. Now I discuss with you education. Educational technology can be tracked back to the paintings on cave walls. People invented paper and began to write down messages or knowledge on paper. After that, people invented the printing press. Now we use educational technologies such as computers, projectors, internet, videos and cameras for teaching and learning. see three pictures. There are educational materials, computers and printing press. So you can see educational materials, some notebooks, pencils, pen, eraser, geometry box, scale, which is our, we used in our education. Then you can see a computer 
means computer our for our teaching and learning then you can see our printing press a printing press is used for print our books or papers now i discuss with you agriculture the first agricultural revolution began many years ago at that time people invented various agricultural tools such as the shovel spade sickle plow etc people used animals such as cows or horses to plow fields now we use a tractor to plow fields and irrigation pumps for watering land We also raise livestock such as cows, sheep, goats, and chickens, and farm fish for getting food. So, dear students, you can also see three pictures: plowing with animal, tractor, and irrigation pump. You can see a man. Plowing field to help of animals, and you can see tractor. People use tractor to plow field to grow more crops, and you can see irrigation pump. It is a watering machine, which is used for watering land. So dear students, I hope you have understood the lesson today's lesson. Okay. Please note down today's homework. Read page sixty-five to sixty-seven and do activity from page sixty-five. I hope you have been still writing. Okay. If you have any inquiry, please contact with me. Thank you.